Hey what's up guys, Dave here, bringing you back with another LCPDFR 1.0 video. Got my colleague with me today. And we're going to police van patrol. I know I did this uh, this vehicle like a while ago, but this time around, I'm going to be doing it in the night time, in the lower part of Al... sorry not Al, Denis, Algonquin. Alright, this is probably the... Uh, I guess it's the 50th time I've refused Al Denis for Algonquin now. On like maybe talking to team people on TeamSpeak or in these videos and whatever. So let's just gently roll out of this police station right now. Still working on all the uh, road signs. As you can see, I haven't done the uh, destinations yet on the walls or anything. Ooh, that taxi. The hell? That's cheeky. That wasn't a taxi, sorry. It was just one of those random vehicles you see on the uh, road. Ta da! I'm not going to do that because everybody knows it's a shots fired and only idiots get shots fired. And they aren't playing as armed police. Oh, did you see that? I think that van just hit that lady and he just knocked that lady down. I want to pull him over. Come, pull a vehicle over, sir. No, don't hit him over again. Wait for it to cross. Ooh, she nearly got hit by that car as well. I'm starting to wonder if she's a jaywalker or, like, if it's genuine. That's right, park right in the middle of the road. Everybody to see. I'll just show him up by turning the sirens on. Alright, let's, let's go um, get my constable standing next to me. I don't know why. Two people in the doorway. Oh shit! What the hell? He's taking off. Hey, come back here! Like Alright, active message. We got a vehicle fleeing off in Union Drive East. It's brilliant. Oh, sorry, man. It's brilliant that ELS 8, you can get the road names now when you're on foot as well as in vehicle. Because in the older versions of my videos, I had to always get back into my car, my van, to uh, find out what road it was. Whereas now, if you're on multiplayer games, you know exactly which street you're on. I'm going to see that guy, but I don't think we're going to have any a good chance. Like, our chances aren't hopeful, <laughs> considering we're going at two miles per hour in this van. Oh, shit, as I said, we've just lost him. That's absolutely dandy. Still, uh... I've done the uh, street lamps now, so watch out. The street lamps are black, like the last patrolling video I did. Those are uh, the Ford Tornio and the Ford Focus are still um, work in progress as well. I hope maybe I can release them this week or on the weekend. I'm not exactly sure yet. Got loads of stuff to catch up with in real life. But let's squeeze past these cars and uh, go to the suspect resisting arrest. I think it's going to be a pursuit, so it's going to be fun. What I noticed is in LCPDFR 1.0, if you're pulling the vehicle over during the pursuit, then what happens is your game crashes, which is a bit stupid, but it just does, you know. I noticed, that, I noticed that's one of the main reasons why my game that crashes from time to time, is just because I get too eager in a pursuit, or I pull my stick out, I hit the cars, wind, like windows out and everything. And then I pull my gun out and like the taser out on the suspect and bang, my game crashes. I think it's something to do with the AI's behaviour, getting confused. The fact that someone else is point pointing a weapon at the suspect and then the game doesn't know what to do. It just bang, you know, just, just flat out crashes. Oh, we nearly boxed this guy in. It's only the last patrol, I was driving with Astra's there. If you think in the next few months I might be... Um, hoping Oh my god, the hell, just crashed as I said. <laughs> it's one thing you don't do, is you don't get out of the vehicle during your pursuit. So, in the next few videos, if I'm in the pursuit, I might not get out of my vehicle to pull a suspect out or aim. I might just let the AI do that for me, because I always seem to crash in a pursuit with lots of vehicles. Yeah, if you're wondering why I haven't done much LC, sorry, London's calling patrols recently, well that's, there's a good reason behind that. A, I it's too much hassle for me to join patrols and B, every time I do join them, 
as I said, I think I said this in one of my previous videos, but this is for you guys that haven't heard recently or probably didn't get a chance to watch them. You better fuck us fucking start watching them now! <laughs> as I said, B, because when I do join them I have to end up getting inv invited like 7 times or so, like 17 times, because I keep on crashing. Not even crashing, just not able to connect. And I've got a really good internet connection, so I do not know what's the, what the hell's wrong with that. I set my NAT type to open and everything, I've turned my firewall off, and I still get, like, you know, connection errors. So, uh, well done, Rockstar, with your um, extremely flawed multiplayer system. Fuck that up as well. <laughs> Alright, so you, uh, you've been uh, pulled over for uh, reckless driving. Give the skit sky out of the vehicle. Alright, put your hands on your head, please. <laughs> also, do not drink while driving, because this guy is so slouched out. Like, look at him, man. He's so. He's so pissed. That's the word for it, pissed. Pissed beyond belief. And it's a weeknight as well. I mean, how sad is that? Obviously, this guy's on, like, Job Seeker's Allowance or something. Let's get a uh, tow truck to take this uh, car away. Ta da! In you go! Stay in there. That's our van, so we're going to drive into the station. But I'm not going to let you guys see all of that. I'm probably going to just clip it out and. Or maybe I'm not. I don't know. I'll have to see at the end of the video. So if you're watching this right now, just carry on watching. What are we doing here? Come on, that, that vehicle really didn't get picked up, did it? <laughs> Just have to uh, drive it onto the grass. There we go. She's inside the car with me as well. How noobish. Look at it. It's just driving around like a piece of shit. It's not even helping out. That is true com comrade ship right there. I put the indicators on anyway just so that so that people know that the car's like you know, knocked out. God, I'm so fucking tired. This must be like 2 o'clock in the morning I'm doing this. So if I sound like being washed up, yep, that's because all day I've just been resetting my GTA and getting it fixed. Just, you know, setting up a new version of GTA for sort of a new series, I guess, and you might find out what that series is going to be like later on, but maybe this week, maybe the next week, but... I think some of you will like it, well actually half of you will probably like it, half of you will think, oh god what have you done? But we'll see, we'll see if it comes out. Let's empty the shit in the toilet, come on get out, there we go, oh that was nice. The van just, take, just took a shit, so uh, we're now empty and waiting for another prisoner. Yeah, beep yourself, you fucker. I hate it when they beep, like, just carry on beeping, like, so fucking rude, and... I'm trying to drive really well, and they're just crap at driving and everything. And in front of us is one of those old-school Vauxhall Astras, in the uh, 1990s or early 2000s livery. I think it's 90s, because it's got those orange and red chevrons. There was a bit of a mini-traffic jam here. Do not ever go on the M25 on a busy day when there's traffic jams. Honestly, you do not want to be stuck on that road. You'll end up going where you want to go two hours later. Or maybe three hours. No, scratch that, five hours. It's a really brutal road. Mm -hmm. Ouch. That wasn't very nice. That tree shouldn't be there. <laughs> it's a hazard to the road. Nothing much to say, to be honest. Things are just boring at the moment. Not on YouTube, but in real life. But like, all I'm doing is just trying to get in back into my schedule and everything. It is really, really brutal. Like, all day I'm going to be doing stuff, and there's only like one or two hours left for YouTube, so. I'll manage, I guess. I really hate not uploading videos as often, like, every day. That's probably something I hate the most. I'd love to ideally be 
uploading every single day, like video, like one video a day for you guys at least. So it's not up to me. I'm not being lazy or anything if I'm not uploading much. It's just that I physically cannot, like literally cannot upload any more videos in my current, I suppose, time frame, the way things are at the moment. But I'll try and make sure there's a video for you guys like every other day or so. Maybe I shouldn't be saying this in the middle of a video, I should be like, you know, making a video on itself, just for saying this, to be honest, because then a lot more of you guys would probably see it, but... Well, that, some people just like watching short videos, they don't like watching long ones, they might just zip through this video, find some fun parts, and think, oh, I've seen enough. For the proper viewers... Yeah, that's practically what I'm talking about right here. Look at this guy. Pull him over and give him a fixed penalty notice. Got some crazy people at the door at the moment, so I have to tell them to shut up. All right, this uh, guy is uh, stopped for going past a red light, I guess, or reckless driving. So get out of the vehicle. Yes. I'm gonna ask you to step aside. Oh dear, we have homeless people. Unable to assist because I'm currently engaged in a situation. Da -da 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 -da. Right, get in the van. You're under arrest. I'm gonna get this car recovered as well. Let's open the doors for him. And there's old Watkins going off in the background. There we go. Just place them next to the van while you're holding them. Press E and they'll automatically get in. You don't have to fuck around and like, you know, open any doors or anything. Just place them there and you're off. A few things have changed if you look at the uh, bus station. You might see a familiar logo on there. Well, some of you guys might might find it familiar. Other guys will think, what the hell's that? Yeah, if you recognise it, just put it down in the comments and I will be, ple I will be pleased. This taxi mod is just... I still can't get over it. It's just amazing. That Dave Doppler guy has done a brilliant job on converting them in. One and only taxi mod. Do some more modern Met Police stuff as well. I don't know why, I just don't like halogen stuff as much as I used to. I just find it boring now, like just old stuff, you just can't relate to it because you never see them in real life. That's why I always do realistic stuff, I only like playing with stuff that I can relate to. And don't go get any ideas now, I'm not going to say anything with a P, D, or you know, C word. So go fuck yourself if you were. Drive into here, empty the shit, flush the chain. There we go, flushing the chain right now. And here we go. Boy, that was nice. We just back up here a bit. Back up, if you don't know what the word back up means in context of reversing, then you are a certified retard. Unable to assist. You look at me, I'm so clever, I can say something in a foreign accent and make people think it's funny, but it's not really funny, it's probably quite racist actually. I don't know why people do that, they're always talking like, if they don't find themselves funny, they'll just say something in like a Russian or a German accent, I expect everybody to laugh. And as expected, nobody laughs, because nobody finds it funny. This is not 1900. People aren't laughing at the width of the Tsar's moustache. People laugh at real things, like, you know, someone who struggles to uh, do stuff. Someone who struggles to do stuff and does a very bad job at it and then, like, you know, get mad, gets mad at people that can do stuff. <laughs> to put it in a few words. There we go, there's the bus stop, as I talked about. And you look at the bus windows, not the, uh, you know, the bus window panes. Not the, sorry, bus stop window panes, not the uh, transport for London round all on top. Because that logo will be over a lot of stuff soon. Let me back up here for a sec.
What's this guy doing? Alright, uh, mate, is this car yours? Yeah, is this car yours? Um, I want some ID first, please, because you really don't look like the type of person to own this car. In fact, you look a bit fucked up, to be honest. There we go. Let's have a look. Don't really look like 19 or anything either. <laughs> Sorry, 22, 23, yeah. You don't look 23 years old either. So, I'm going to wait for the uh, radio to come in. And they will confirm you. Request ID check, F12. I'm still figuring out how to change your name. Like, you know, Officer Sandberg, you know, Sandberg, you should say Officer Davis, and that'd be really cool. Or my, my uh, call sign, PY03. Then I'm going to end it here, because it's getting late, and I won't have any other like time to do anything else, so... Thanks for watching guys, don't forget to rate, comment, share, subscribe, and yeah, this wasn't this guy's car, he was just like pulling the Mickey Mouse on me. I'll see you in another video soon, so uh, keep watching, don't run off, you know, if, if you're going to run off, go grab some popcorn and come right back. Ha 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 ha, really funny bad joke. Alright, get this guy, I'm too lazy to take him to uh, prison myself, so I'm going to call him like, an extra unit. And I'll, uh, I'll join you guys shortly in another video, so yeah, pretty cool. It's all good.